What's better on a fall day than to watch a video of a UK sovereign citizen slash freeman on the land go to a police station to do, I don't know, what looks like a First Amendment audit, not wearing masks during the pandemic, and asking to serve notice while being concerned about 5G. <laughs> <laughs> Prepare to have your day made. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in to the Common Sense Academy. I'm your host, Joe Pometto, Joe the Lawyer. If you like my content, please like, subscribe, comment, and share. Also, I wrote a book on sovereign citizens. I wrote the book on sovereign citizens. There was a link in the description below. Before we watch this video, raise your cup, your glass in the air. Oh, you know it, my old friends, my new friends. It tastes better when we sip together. I like Diet Dr. Pepper. Cheers. Get a kick out of this video. It's a little bit long, but stick around or tune in to the end to watch my commentary on it. This is a little slow, but it is hilarious. Let's watch. Well, I don't want to snatch hey, the phone. Uh, I'm going into the cop shop here in Bangor again for the seventh time I know, uh, to report uh, 5G uh, as a uh, demonstrable crime against, against the people of this country. And I'm going to hand them in um, a few notes. No I'm going to hand them in a notice to Carl Folks. And I've got a lobby the Bobby campaign. Um, and I've got their oath that they've forgotten. And a few other bits and bobs. So we're going to go in there. And there's six of us. Matt Hancock, where there's only six of us, so we're well within the road. So, come on guys, come into Bangor Station. Let's meet the police officers. Hello. Yes. No, we're allowed to film it in our Section 2048A of the Terrorism Act, yeah? It's it's a pub. No, I want to see the. Oh my god. The sergeant, please! Cuckoo! I'm going to try and come and arrest us or something. Must have something to hide if they don't want to be on camera. Get the sergeant or get Sebastian! Detective Sebastian! Or Gareth! Right, you're getting paid by us here, you know! Get the sergeant, please! They probably don't even know any laws they were talking about mentioning or anything like that. They know nothing about the law. You're allowed to film under Section 2048A of the Terrorism Act, as long as you're not training up terrorists, which we're not. They're the terrorists. Government's training the terrorists. I mean, the police, the police don't even know the law. We're not leaving till somebody comes to see us! Hi mate, who are you? Who are you? I'm Matty. Hi. Right. Who are you? Sergeant. You're the sergeant? Yeah. Is there a different sergeant then? Sorry? Are you on your oath? What do you mean? Are, are you on, on your oath? Well, no, when, you know when you signed up to be a policeman, I do solemnly and seriously declare and right. affirm that I will well and truly Matthew. serve the Queen Matthew. in the office of constable with fairness, integrity, Diligence and impartiality upholding fundamental fundamental human rights, okay? Right. Yeah. Do you remember saying all this? Yeah. That is your oath. That is your oath. Yeah. Is it all of you together? 
No, this is only two at a time here. Six. Yeah. 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 No, she's three one one time, yeah. Uh, guys, uh, three one time. Okay, I want to report Craig, then. Yeah, I will. We'll speak to you. Okay. Yeah. If you're friends, then please leave. Yeah. I'm not filming, though. Yeah, because you're all filming it. You can have one thirty still. Okay, sorry. Okay, should we? Should we? Yeah. And I want to be taken seriously this time. Right. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. And I want you to look into it, guys, please. You need to stop. You need to stop. Come in here with phones. I'm allowed to, you, yeah, section we'll, 48A no, no, yeah. of the Terrorism Act. Right. Yeah, 48A. Yeah, check it out. Is that the Terrorism Act? Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah,
Right, okay. Yeah. You, you don't care, though. Well, what do you get paid for? To do with time. Yeah, what claims to deal with? Right. Yeah, what claims to deal with? All kinds. Yeah. So if somebody to pass a claim, what do you do about it then? Do you? Well, we're reporting the crime. Yeah. Are you going to look into it? He's putting his gloves on. Tell you what, we've already asked nicely, but it's only two at a time, yeah? So there's three here again. I know you've asked nicely, yeah? So can just one of you leave, yeah? Doesn't matter who, just as long as there's two left, yeah? Because everyone else abides by the same guidelines. Can, can you, man? Can, 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 no, I, their guidelines make this not law. I, I mentioned the Constitution to you earlier, yeah? You, don't, you haven't got a clue, have you? Mate, how, 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 Moitre, am I? I mean, if you are wait, how can I wait? How am I waiting? What have you got better to do then? I better think we've got crime on the go. What crime have you got on the go? What crime have you got on the go? Don't lie to me. I'm not lying to you. You are lying to me. Look me in the eye then. I can tell you're lying to me. Yeah. Stop lying to me. Okay, can I go back to do my job then? Or am I going to have to stand here? I was not over and over with you. No, memorize that. I already know this, don't I? Do you? Yes, I do. Yeah, so you can is there anything else you need from us today? I want you to do your civic duty. But I mean, you said that I passed them all, yeah? Yeah. You said that the CID officers... And I've reported the crime. Listen, the yeah. CID officers dealing with it. Do, do, you know, do you know how bad this is going to look for yeah. you? Is, is there anything else other than adding to your other crime that you've That's on the go investigation with the CID, yeah? Yeah, I would like to, to fulfil your constitutional duty. Right, we're just going around and around here. Yeah, no, it's a bit boring, isn't it? So, Can we have your nice. name and badge number as well, yeah, since you're the one that's passed? And your name, please. Yeah, Will, my name is. Just, just Will? Yeah, just Will. You don't need anything further than is that, that, no? Is that all? That's it. Do you need anything else now? Can, can we have, like, your your full name? I've just given it to you. Oh, yeah. just Will, then. Can, can I get your full name? No, no. I'm not giving you my legal you're, fiction. Right? You're obliged to give us your name, yeah? Okay, hey guys, he's just called Will. You're in a public place here, yeah? Yeah, yeah. No, I don't have to, that's... It's oh not law, God, no. you know the law. I asked you if you know the law. You don't have to wear masks. You can't. You can't. You can't enforce. You can't enforce me to wear masks. What's your name as look. well? I'm bad for you. Look, look. Yeah, look right yeah. guys, they don't have to give you I'm their name. I'm not giving you my legal fiction. I've given it to Gareth before. Who's Gareth? Gareth is one of your colleagues. Okay. Yeah. Maybe if he gave us a second name, we'd be able to identify him better. Right. Yeah, you What's know. Where, where do you will, live, then, mate? No name at all, yeah? Where do you live? No, but at, at the moment, you know, where... What, what's your name and where do you live? Uh, we haven't been yeah. the crime, have we? No, no I no. haven't either, have I? At the moment... You, what, what you, have you got your book out for? You're committing offences by not wearing masks. But, uh, can you read that? Just... Well, which... What is the... What is the law that you're trying to tell me here? The COVID regulations. The regulations, yeah. They're regulations. You just said it yourself. They're not law, are they? Well, they're an act parliament, of parliament, we, yeah. We, we, can, we can get into court, yeah, and they can decide what they want to do with it, yeah? We'll do, the same, do the same with you, mate. We'll do the same with you if you want to get like that. We'll put a claim on tarts when you. No, we can go down that if you want, yeah, just to you. What? Are you going to take me to court now for reporting a claim? Is that what you're telling me? You're the word can, can we just get that on camera, please? <laughs> you're going to take me to court for reporting a claim? You're not your mask in a public place, yeah? You can't, you can't do that, mate. It's legislation. Yeah, you can't. Yeah, you can't. Legislation yeah. for its hand force it's, of the law needs consent. Yeah. And we don't consent. We, yeah, exactly, mate. We're governed uh, by we're consent. Done, we're done, we're done, policed we, by uh, consent. You're I would read for profit corporation. Read the cop. I read. I would read. Yes, I would read. I what, you what your constitutional duties are. I tell are. you what. I tell you what. Mm -hmm. Why are you the police station? Phone it. Phone it in. Why would they want to do that? I've just talked to you and you. Because we're unable to deal with things at the moment. We're busy with other things. Yeah. So if you want, report them after one on one. Mm -hmm. Go record it. You'll get a reference number as you've requested. I can understand what you're saying, mate. We, you've right. understood for the last few minutes, practically. Yeah, no, it's all muffled for me, isn't it? Yeah, no, but you can understand what I'm telling you. Will you, you take those masks off when you get What's, back to do that? So, if, why, why, why would they run a phone in when they come, come here in person? Well, I can't give you a reference number. They can. Why can't you? Because I don't. Because so you, you don't, you don't fulfil your civic duty, and you've forgotten your oath. 
going around and around. Yeah. No, no, we're not going around. Right. We're going around. Yeah. You continue to spread about. You'll be arrested for disorderly conduct in the police station. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, like. Nice one, lads. So take the masks off. We're uh, taking them off, not it. Well, they were really helpful, they were fantastic to yeah. Yeah. Uh, Do you want to do a finish? Uh, well, there you go, that's North Wales Police. Again, guys, uh, our finest, uh, the boys in blue, upholding their civic duties and looking after us. That's what you pay your tax money for. So, I have a confession to make, everyone, and if you watch my show long enough, you know that I am terrible at accents. However, I think a video in a foreign country always spices it up a little bit. I'll be honest, I'm a big fan of UK British accents. Um, I like all the accents in English in one way or another, though. People say the Pittsburgh accent, where I'm from, where we say yins and jagoff is one of the worst. Anyway, we got to watch this 5G, 5G, 5G Sovereign citizen free men on the land go into a police station in Bangor, uh, UK. Apparently him and a couple other guys or girls walk in, two or four of them, all right? They're ringing the doorbell. They want to serve notice on these officers, okay? They want to serve notice, a piece of paper about 5G, walking in without masks, all right? You can tell a woman comes uh, up to them right away and, excuse me, doesn't really want to talk to them. They come back with multiple officers and these nutcases proceed to waste at least 15 minutes of these officers time now right off the bat the officer telling the social distance and there's only there can only be two in the room at a time oh spread out spread out what don't you understand about only two all right there's four of you you can't just spread out he said get out so i believe two of them leave and we're left with our star free man on the land and his cameraman who is sitting behind him <coughs> they want to serve some sort of notice appears to be a 5g notice is it just me or are the 5g nut jobs more prominent in Europe. I don't know. I don't know. You know, everybody here is talking. We, we get a lot of flack over here in the United States for, uh, you know, for the things that go on in our country and our politics. But Europe seems to have the lockdown on 5G. <coughs> okay. So he's going to serve them. Notice the cops are ignoring them. They're talking to them. Okay. He pulls some classic sovereign citizen lines. He's, you're getting paid by us. You're getting paid by us. I bet that most of these sovereign citizens don't pay much taxes, if any. You know what, dude? Pay your taxes, then maybe you can open your mouth, all right? Just like if you vote, if you want to complain about the president or somebody, go vote. Pay your taxes. Okay, he tells them to leave. They're not leaving. They're just they're so childlike, right? That's the sovereign citizen. The whole thing is, is like, it's like these people have never matured. They still live in infancy. That's why they grab on to these lunatic arguments. Tells the officer, are you under oath? Um, they, they just came in here to hassle these police officers. And you know what? You know what? I think he's going to leave with a ticket. I think these cops had it in order to write him a ticket for not having a mask. So, um... You know, he, he, he also tells the cops at one point, the, the officer says, I want to be taken seriously. <clears throat> I have some advice for anybody who wants to be taken seriously. <clears throat> I can't talk right now, okay? Something like, okay? Hmm. If you want to be taken seriously, be a serious person. If you're using this 5G nonsense, you're not being a serious person. Then they try to draw the difference between legislation and law. Something to understand here, people, and this applies probably in most democracies <coughs> with an executive branch, a judicial branch, and a congressional branch. The executive branch can pass things like executive orders or certain types of mandates that have the force of law because the grant or the, the power was granted to them either through the Constitution or through legislation. So not every law or rule that has the force of law has to be put into place immediately by a piece of legislation that's incorrect, that's constitutionally incorrect. Go do your homework. Don't find these little loopholes and arguments, all right, to, to talk your nonsense. Then he wants a receipt for this notice. He wants a receipt for this document. He's right. He's got it on video. You don't get receipts every time you hand off a document, okay, especially some goofy document like this. 
um, you can sign your own receipt. All right, that's how it works in the law. If you serve someone, you sign that that person was served. The person who's, who's being served doesn't have to sign your nonsense. They don't have to do it. Okay, uh, some other classic uh, sovereign citizen, you work for a corporation, the government's corporation, government's corporation. Okay, well, if the government's corporation, why are you paying taxes and how are they employed by you? If that's the case, then you're a part of it. Then you're a part of it. You're paying the employees for the corporation. You're part of the corporation. Okay. And then he says to the cops, this was a good one. He says, what do I, what do you get paid for? He goes, to deal with crime. <laughs> exactly. Not to deal with time wasters like you. Please get a job. Get a job. Do something. Man, you're killing me. Um, they pull out the name and badge number, name and badge number, because the officer starts asking for him information. His information is going to cite him for a mask violation. Please get him. Please get him. Okay. And, um, and you know, that, that pretty much wraps it up. After ways about 15 minutes of time, these 5G Freeman on the land nutcases walk out of there and give the officers some time to breathe. I mean, what do those officers do? They go back there and laugh and smile and kick it. Um, you know, I, I love the videos when they come in and the police just arrest them immediately. I mean, you see that in the U.S. sometimes with the First Amendment auditors. Um, you know, it's the only way to get these people to learn. They're wasting time. They're wasting taxpayer dollars. I'm not sitting here advocating for the arbitrary arrest. But, um, you know, if these people are violating laws, write them up for it. Okay, thank you for tuning in to Common Sense Academy. I'm Joe Palmetto. Joe the Lawyer, hope you had fun today. Uh, like, subscribe, comment, and share. Buy my book, Christmas is Coming. It's in the description below. Peace out.